This is Raspberry Pi, and I'm looking at the speed of web browsing. So I'll launch the Midori web browser. Now, there's a couple of things I'm doing to make this faster. The Pi itself is overclocked, so the arm runs at a gigahertz. And we're also using the new Raspbian hard float distribution. Um, this will be the next official Wheezy image. So let's just look at a simple web page. So, so the register is fairly straightforward and you can see it loads quite quickly. And we can navigate quickly. So there's, there's no problem with simple websites. We can look at something a bit more complicated. The BBC's website comes up reasonably quickly. You know, it, it uses JavaScript for kind of navigation. And again, it seems to be running fairly well. Um, you'll be familiar with the Raspberry Pi web page. Again, it's come up fairly quickly. And it's quite a long web page, but fairly simple. But that seems fine. Um, and now the big one. So this famously um, got us slated for being very slow rendering and gadgets web page, which is a bit of a monster. Um, it's a huge web page with a lot of images, and on any machine it tends to render slowly. But on here it's it's not unusable. You know, it takes a number of seconds, and I believe that's that's fully loaded. We can now scroll through it. And as you see, it's a huge web page, lots of images. But it's not unusable.